I'd like to model the problem that you've been working on, 637 minus 253. And I want you to think about how closely what you see me show you matches with what you thought and what you did on your own. So I put in a vertical equation, but of course I also want to have a chip model. So I'm gonna make a place value chart showing my ones, tens, and hundreds. I'm wondering if you could help me count to 637, please. Can you? Help me, please. 100. 631. question for you. Should I also put 253 on my chip model? No. Why not? Because it's takeaway. It is subtraction. That means I'm starting with this amount and then I'm taking the 253 away. I'm not combining anything, but I'm taking away. So I'm going to start my uh, subtraction problem in the One. ones place. You guys are so smart, excellent job. So if I have seven ones and I take three ones away, how many are left? Four. That's right, seven minus three equals four. four. Now I'll go to my tens place. And I see in the tens place I have 30 minus 50. That seems a little funny to me. I see some funny faces. You're looking like, can't do that. If I have 30 cookies, can I give you 50? Yes. You think? Yeah, no. Yes. I'm no magician. Yes, you are. So I'm, I'm going to unbundle 100 and rename those as 10s. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. And now I don't have 600s anymore. I only have five. And I also don't have just three tens. I now have 13 tens. And 13 tens, is that enough to take five tens away? Yeah. It is. What is 13 minus five? Eight, you guys are good, very good. And then if I have in my hundreds place five minus two or 500 minus 200 equals 300. Did you get 384? Excellent job.